cornered! Cornered? <laughs> it is you who have painted yourselves into a corner. Poor drab fools! <laughs> Behold! I am beauty personified! Artistry made flesh! I am Dora in grey! Worship me! Worship the woman who lured poor innocent people into a trap so she could turn them into paintings? Not likely. But why? Why did you do all of this? <laughs> why? For beauty, of course. For my masterpiece. Each of you will be a splash of color on my magnificent canvas. Should welcome such a fate. Oh, how I wish that greatest of beings had given me this gift sooner. And the world is so much better for it. You allow your basest urges to bring you to me, and I transform you into something altogether less ugly. I don't cry when I say the mural brings fortune. It brings the good fortune of becoming a part of my masterpiece! <gasps> Look out, everyone! Easy. 
Nice! I just keep getting better. Oh, goody. an ancient kingdom by possessing one of its most powerful people. Could now what be the ruins of that kingdom? She said something about wanting him to live forever. Is that what Mordigan wants? The magic key, eh? Well, if nothing else, we'll be able to open a door or two we couldn't before. There's a nice wee bonus for our troubles, eh? We save the day again. What is happening, please? So many people are coming out of the ruins. <gasps> what in the name of heaven? You have done something to our mural. Where is it? Tell me. We're free! We're back in the real world! Thank crikey for that! <laughs> and don't come back, you stupid painting! <laughs> the real world? What is he talking about, please? No, you are lying! The mural did all these terrible things? If this is true, then we owe you a great debt, friends. Ready? I must thank you before you go. You have saved our town and given me many great new business ideas into the bargain. <sighs> Goodbye to the home of the fortune bringing mural and hello to the town of the mural that swallows humans whole. <laughs> Tourists love scary stories. Now I must go. I have a fresh batch of replica murals to sell. <laughs> ha, 
They certainly know how to spin a set back into a sail round these parts, eh? We'd better be putting our best foot forward, too. I'm sure I remember seeing a door with the same symbol as the key on it over in Svarsrust. It was near that Warrior's Rest Inn. But let's not get too bogged down in the old treasure hunting, though, eh, laddie? Grab's right. We need to get moving.
Here we are, the Crystal Kingdom of Sniffelheim, home to the famous Blue Orb. Ah, it's a fair wee while since I've visited, but it warms my heart to be back. Hmm. That must be about the only thing that is warm around here. <laughs> huh? What's this? What the? The gates are covered in ice! How strange. Still, I suppose it's only natural they'd ice up in a climate as cold as this. Natural, my foot. What about all the people inside? Ah, you have a point there, lassie. So, what are we supposed to do? Well, if we can't go in through the front door, we'll just have to head round the back. He's been turned to ice. It's just like what happened to the gates. This doesn't seem natural at all. This may be the Crystal Kingdom, but it shouldn't be frozen solid, cold winter or no. in town finally someone who hasn't been turned into a block of ice hmm. well it all began three months ago it was a bright sunny day just like any other when suddenly a strange shadow filled the sky it was a witch <gasps> a witch my goodness that sounds like something from a fairy tale. Just so. She chanted an ancient incantation. And just like that, the town was engulfed in a ferocious... 
vicious snowstorm. The wind took my breath clean away, and before I knew it, I had fainted. And... She must be a pretty powerful witch to freeze this whole city with a single spell. I wish I could help, but all this ice is more than my magic can melt. Hmm. By the way, Missy, that symbol in your shawl, is that not... Oh, forgive me. I haven't introduced myself yet, have I? I am Frisabeth, Queen of Sniffelheim. You're the Queen? So, does that mean the old King is...? I'm afraid so. My father passed away last year. It looks like Sniffelheim's in a bit of a sticky situation. I suppose now isn't a good time to ask about the orb. An orb? What kind of orb? Why, the big blue ball that's been handed down in your family for generations, lassie. The truth be told, we need to borrow it. <gasps> oh, oh, of course. You would be welcome to borrow it, but I'm afraid it is locked up tight inside the castle. Well, that's just perfect. So if we don't find a way to melt that ice, we'll never get our hands on the orb. Hmm. Maybe if we got rid of that wicked witch, it might break her spell. I thought just the same thing. Why, only a few days ago, a band of soldiers from a faraway land came here to investigate what was happening. I sent them out to try and find the witch and fight her, but I haven't seen them since. Well, we can't very well leave them out in the cold. Let's go and give those soldiers a hand and bring spring back to Sniffelheim, shall we? Oh, thank you, thank you. The Wicked Witch dwells in the Hexwood. Be very, very wary, for the witch does not live in the woods alone. Aye, we'll be sure to keep an eye out.
this. Oh, yeah. Told you I was tough. Another one bites the dust. <laughs> <laughs> 